Hi guys, welcome back. Um, if it's the first time you've seen this channel, please have a look at the other stuff. If you're into some weird, wonderful, creative ideas, um, like this one, uh, Predator Build, check that out. Um, check all the other videos. Um, thumbs it up, subscribe, comment down below, all that monarchy. Um, today we're gonna be doing uh, an enclosure for a Frixo Palma Lagunas. Um, beautiful blue spider. Um, she needed a bit of an upgrade, so we're just going to give her a small little enclosure. It's actually one of my own builds. Um, also, we're going to rehouse a couple of tiger rumps and uh, finish it off with a couple of feeding videos from today. So, without any ado, let's get on with it. Alright guys, this is one of my own builds, so in the back. <coughs> I've done a bark background wall and uh, what I did as well, this is a little hide that goes around the back there. So what we're going to do now is just add a couple more fake plants, leaf litter and everything and then rehouse the spider. Right, I do these. It's not going to be its final enclosure, but why not make every little enclosure worthwhile and a bit of a display, especially with some of these spiders because they're so slow growing. You know, they're in some of these enclosures for ages until they okay go into that final enclosure so we might as well make it look cool these all right so now's the time for rehousing and then fix a palma lagunas and she was a bit moody when i just took her out of her last enclosure so let's see what she's going to be like now A little bit moody. It's a stunning spider. I love the blue spider spiders in this. Yeah, it's going to be one of my favourites. A good great good eaters. Um, it's molted three times since in my care, so I've had it about uh, about eight months now. So he's hoping it's not. Hope it's not a male, but he don't see many of these about. So it's always good to share. Here we go. This is stunning. It's a nice little enclosure for her. As I said, she doesn't actually, she's out all the time. Absolutely all the time. Never burrows, never hides away. So, in that case, these are a good, good one. Nice display spider.
Right guys, so what we're doing, we're doing a double rehouse, so it's a basic setup. I'm not doing anything fancy with these because they're not too big yet. So we've got a bit of cork bark goes down, plenty of substrate in there. And I use bottle lids as water dishes. Easiest way to do it. really docile. Flicky flicky. That's number one. This one's a bit bigger. That's a bit banana, a bit better push on it for that stunner. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that one. Nice little enclosure uh, for that one, but she'll get an awesome build by the time she gets to adult because that's awesome. It is probably one of my favorite spiders. Fantastic eaters, never burrows, always out in the open, always fear. So what more can you ask for in a spider, really? Um, I've tried to steer away from pet holes altogether, really, because I just don't see the point anymore. You do get some nice spiders, like cobalt blues and all that sort of stuff, but you never see them, so don't want them. Um, so apart from that, um, see you again next time. As usual, thumbs up, comment down below, ring that bell. So you get notified when the next video is out. Doesn't cost you a penny, but it means a lot to me. Thank you very much, guys. That's it. Apart from that, I shall see you later.